Hey everybody, thanks for tuning in to the video. We're all aware of the uh, mall shooting uh, that happened on Saturday, and it's always uh, horrible when anybody uh, uh, gets hurt or killed, uh, no matter how, which, you know, how the means were that they were killed. Um, and uh, the name of this video is, uh, is Katy Perry Anti-Gun. And the reason I bring it up, and, and I'll show you here in a minute, um, you know, hours after that happened, uh, Katy Perry sent out uh, three different tweets um, that doesn't come straight out and say that she's anti-gun, but you can definitely tell, in my opinion anyway, uh, that she's anti-gun. So um, I'll show you the, the tweets, and uh, I'll let you guys uh, be the judge. So here's the Twitter page uh, for Katy Perry. And I have nothing against her. You know, uh, she seems to very, be a very nice uh, young woman. Uh, very pretty looking young woman. Uh, seems to be very, very talented. Um, and uh, she was, I saw her on the Grammys last night. As you can see, she's, uh, you know, very popular. Uh, almost 50 million uh, followers. So, you know, that's great. You know, she, she's um, got tons of money. Um, you know, just checking on, looking, uh, uh, you know, about her, you know, before I did this video. She does a lot of uh, charity work, so, you know, fantastic. But I just want to show you the three tweets that she sent out later in the day after the shooting at, at, at the mall on Saturday. And uh, you just be the, the judge and see if it comes out to how I take it that, that, uh, uh, that she's definitely anti-gun. So here are the uh, three tweets uh, from Katy Perry that I want you guys to see and then you can make up your minds. Uh, uh, and come to the conclusion that you want to and, and you know, like I said the conclusion I came to that she's making a stance on on guns and uh, you know she you know is a anti most likely anti-gun from what I'm getting it and she wants uh, uh, some type of gun control so um, let me go ahead and read it for you you guys can read along with it is anyone else really sad about the constant stream of shootings and how normal it's becoming to see these headlines on a weekly basis question mark well, of course, everybody said uh, when anybody is killed, and it doesn't matter the means that they were killed, uh, all around it's, it's, it's sad when anybody is killed or injured. The next one is one that really gets me scared to go to school, question mark, scared to go to the mall, question mark, scared to go to the movies, question mark, me too. When will there be actual, in all caps, change, question mark, how many more, question mark, it looks like explanation mark. Well, She's a, she's a public figure, and I'm I'm sure that you know she's probably had trouble with you know maybe stalkers or something like that. I don't I don't know, but you know it, it's amazing when people want to have uh, you know call for gun control uh, and and things like that. That a lot of these stars and politicians calling for it, who have tons and tons and millions of dollars, that that can afford to have uh, you know uh, security or armed guards, uh, uh, what what have you. Uh, but uh, people like us who are law-abiding citizens, you know, we don't have that luxury and the police are, you know, not uh, close enough to, to, uh, to save your lives. So you have to be able to protect yourselves. So, uh, Katy Perry, if you're uh, insinuating that there should be a change as far as gun control, um, you're wrong there. And then the last one, uh, you and I both know it's getting embarrassing. My heart goes out to all the victims and their families this week I pray for change and so like I said you guys can read into this whatever you want uh, you know but I read into it uh, you know she's making a stance that she's you know anti-gun um, and she wants some type of gun control so uh, I just want to let you guys know that uh, thanks for watching and we'll see you next time